Jacksonville's Tulsa Welding School, well, it's expanding as the demand for welders grows and more people show interest in learning the trade in the River City. News for Jack's reporter Brianna Andrews spoke with TWS Jacksonville about the new options available to the community. Welders have a particular set of skills, high in demand, and it's piquing interest of people living here in Jacksonville. Now, Tulsa Welding School in Jacksonville is expanding its program to keep up. Enrollment has been doing very well, and we saw a need to possibly do an overnight welding shift, which is new for us starting on August 12th. Uh, the class will run from 12 uh, a.m. till 5.15 a.m. So. We're excited about that. If you're not sure what welding is, it's the process of bonding metals using heat and pressure. It's used across several industries from aerospace, manufacturing, shipping, the automotive industry, infrastructure, and renewable energy. Michael Cole, the regional campus president with TWS Jacksonville, says more young people are interested in the trade. When I started here at Tulsa Welding, uh, we, we had a much older group of students that were coming in, more of the adult style students, I'd say 35 up to 60, but we've seen a huge influx of the high school market and younger folks or people that started a career out of college that didn't really necessarily like the career and have shifted over. Cole also says there's an uptick of minorities learning welding. So we've seen a lot more minority students come in and enroll into the program. And lastly, pretty proud and pretty cool, we're seeing a lot more women. When I started, it was about one, two percent. We're probably about three, four, five percent right now on our female demographic. Even with this increased interest, the American Welding Society says there's a shortage of more than 375,000 welders. If becoming a welder is something you're considering, there are some things to keep in mind. There are admissions requirements. They have to have a high school diploma in order to come into the program. Uh, they'll have to go through the, the, the admissions process in an interview with the financial aid representative. If you are interested in attending Tulsa Welding School, you can call the school directly or step by in person to learn more information about its program. You can also go over your financial options there as well. The school's contact information is posted under this story on our website, newsforjacks.com. Brianna Andrews, Channel 4, The Local Station.